Hey Sequoia Nation, Coach Curtis here for another Coach's Corner. Uh, thanks for joining. Wanted to kind of share something that's going on with me personally, and I've been getting a lot of questions as far as like, well, what does coaching kind of do? What what can I get out of it? How is this helping? That, those sorts of questions continually come up because coaching is a new thing, uh, and trying to grow anything new is going to be a lot of questions, which I love. So keep the questions coming. And I'm experiencing something right now where my shoulder all week. Uh, a weekend kind of almost went out on me. I couldn't move my neck. I had to get out of bed this morning. Um, my throat got felt really constricted on Saturday morning. And, you know, we could chalk it up to another bug going on the house. I live with, you know, two, my two girls are three and five, but, um, but I, th that wasn't the case. Uh, looking deeper, there were other things going on that my body was trying to tell me. And so I'm taking this opportunity to, to share with you my journey a little bit because um, my, I woke up Saturday morning and I looked it up and, and um, the throat has something to do with withholding, expressing anger. So for me, that really resonates. Uh, and my shoulder um, is on this liver meridian, which is about territorial, which is up. So if something happening at home that I'm having a hard time accepting and having a hard time kind of speaking my truth. So all of these things kind of ring true. Uh, and when I kind of recognize that, I, I know it's not the bugs but I do know that there's things I can do about it to make sure that I, I'm expressing, using my voice and making sure that I'm feeling heard uh, in my life. So just, just some examples of kind of how the neuroemotional is connected to, to structural, the physical. And there are no accidents, right? And that's why I'm so passionate about, about what we do here is because there's, there's always more to the story. And the beauty is that life is happening for us to learn more and to understand more about these things that, that we can then transform certain things in our life so that we don't have to continue to feel like this. And our body can then be at ease and rest assured knowing that, um, that everything will be okay because we're learning how to take care of ourselves. And that really is kind of the biggest piece of coaching is I can't take care of you for you. Dr. Schilling can't take care of you for you. We can educate you, we can facilitate all these processes and empower you to understand certain things. But at the end of the day, it's up to you to, to recognize certain things, kind of go deeper and through that understanding, take action and change certain things that you want to see changed. And that's going to actually change your physiology down, down the road. So um, that is just something I wanted to share with you as a real life concrete example of something I'm going through that maybe has happened to you. Maybe you had things pop up in certain areas of the body and not really sure why. Um, and unless you are injured, um, absence of some sort of external force or trauma, things are happening on the inside that uh, are way more interesting, a lot more fun to, to know about too. So uh, what kind of questions do you have? Keep those questions coming, um, comment below, and look forward to talking to you soon. Ciao for now.